Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how you can increase the disk size of a Hyper-V virtual machine. So I have a Hyper-V virtual machine which is running Windows 10 operating system and if I go into the settings of the VM, I can see two virtual hard disks. The first one is with the default size of 127 gig and it is used for C drive and the second one is for D drive of 100 gig. And I'm going to add another 50 gig to make the total size of the disk as 150 gig. And if I go into the guest operating system and I'll right click on start and click on disk management. And inside disk management, I can see the same disk layout. So C drive is of 127 gig and D drive is of 100 gig. All right, I'm back in my Hyper-V manager. So I'm going to right click on the VM and click on settings. And I will click on my second virtual hard disk under SCSI controller. And on the right side, you can see the edit button is grayed out. This is because there's a snapshot for this VM, which is called a checkpoint in Hyper-V. So first I need to delete the checkpoints before I can increase the virtual hard disk size. By the way, you don't need to shut down the VM to increase the virtual hard disk size. Okay, I will click on cancel. I've already selected the Windows 10 virtual machine. I'm going to right click on the automatic checkpoint and click on delete checkpoint, which will delete the checkpoint. Now, if you have multiple checkpoints under the parent checkpoint, then you need to right click on the parent checkpoint and click on delete checkpoint subtree to delete the child checkpoints. I just have a single checkpoint for this VM and I've already right clicked on that. So I'm going to click on delete checkpoint and click on delete. All right, the merging is in progress and it completed. Now I'm going to right click on the Windows 10 VM again and click on settings. So I'm going to click on the second virtual hard disk, which is used for D drive. And this is the disk for which I want to increase the size. And on the right side, you can see the edit button is not grayed out anymore. So I'm going to click on that. On the locate virtual hard disk window, I'm going to click next. In the choose action screen, the expand option is already selected and this option will expand the size of the virtual disk. So I'm going to click next. You can see the current size is 100 gig. So I'm going to add another 50 gig to make the new size as 150 gig. So I will specify 150 here and click next and click finish, I'll click OK. And now I'm going to open up the VM console. I'll go back to disk management. Now you can see the free space that shows up on the far right side on the virtual hard disk. Just in case if it does not show up, simply click on actions and click on rescan disks and click actions again and click refresh. Right click on the partition that you want to expand and click on extend volume. Click next on the welcome screen. Okay, so I had 50 gig available and by default it took all of the 50 gig. But if you don't want to make use of entire free space, you can just say 1024, which is just one gig. But in my case, I'm going to make use of the entire free space. So I'm going to type 51200 and click next and click finish. All right, you can see now the total size of D drive is 150 gig. Okay, so this is how you expand the virtual hard disk size of a Hyper-V VM. I hope you like this video. For more videos like these, please subscribe to my channel.